inferring geometric constraints. In a later uh, videos, we'll learn about geometric constraints. You can find those under the parametric uh, tab. But my word of warning is until you understand that whole parametric tab, you don't want these things on. So let's just make sure that we know what not to poke. Okay. So in our status bar, inferring geometric constraints is turned off by default. So I'm going to go over to customization and I'm going to go up to infer. Uh, constraints and turn it on. Now, with the constraints here, I have infer constraints. Right now it's off. I'm going to turn it on. Don't do this. All right. So when I draw lines, you'll see that I get these little blue filled in rectangles or squares. These are constraints these tie these two lines together so you can't pull them apart or edit them or bust them apart so every time we go to draw now we end up with those blue constraints uh, messing up our drawing if you will because it's doing a whole different function when we're using constraints so we want that off so I want to make sure that's off and not being used. Now when I draw lines, they're individual line segments. So just don't go and turn that on. I would leave it right alone. I would just turn it off and I would not have that on whatsoever. So I just wouldn't even play with it until you learn parametric constraints. So all right. So inferring geometric constraints just don't turn on don't play with it until you start learning parametric drafting